G'day. So a couple of people have asked for tours of Collie. So that's a canopy I got for $500 on Facebook Marketplace. A couple of 12 volt solar panels that I get from Full Drive Supercenter. Hashtag not sponsored. I've got a dual battery kit. This is all temporary, obviously, um, that I've run through the wall there that goes to the little King's isolator. I've got a bunch of Victron Smart stuff in there that I've had for ages. You can see there, batteries at 100%. Super cheap, literally. Super cheap auto power inverter, little solar controller, and three 120 amp hour AGM batteries for the, uh, again, from King's. Um, this is going to be the kitchen. I still haven't decided exactly what I'm doing. I'm not set on keeping the Waco. I like the idea of having a freezer as well as a fridge. Um, so I might go to a dual zone or I might go to an upright style fridge. Don't know. Um, I'm not set on keeping these army trunks in the middle, but for now, they're great storage. <coughs> That's just got um, recovery gear in it. On the back, uh, tools and I'm going to get some bunning storage things there for little bolts and nuts and fuses and screws and bits and pieces. Um, again, it's a work in progress. It'll do more as I do more. Here's the mess of my bedroom. So it's just a swag laid on top of um, a little bit of stuff I whacked in there. I'll show you a better picture of that. <coughs> so that's just stuff I bought from Bunnings and cut to size. Um, these are the starts of insulating doing more i've got a really old ipad it's like 10 years old on the roof the reason the cable's plugged in battery doesn't work anymore so without the cable it won't run each of the doors has um, screens in it but the ventilation isn't good enough i'm going to have to get some sort of fan in here i do have that little roof hatch in there we'll see how that all goes um, on this side of the collie, there is a toolbox I need to put back there. Again, work in progress. Um, the hinges up here need replacing. They're about 60 bucks each. Um, they just leak like a sieve. You might see there. I've added a little bit of silicon. And it doesn't leak on the bedside anymore, but does leak on the other side. But I traded seven sheep. Um, which I was going to grow out and do stuff to buy all this stuff. So in many ways, it's been cash neutral. Um, Collie is what I already had. And, and the fact that this camper sits so bloody perfectly on here. And yes, I've got a plan for that. I'm going to put a little water tank through the bottom of there to keep the weight in, the, in forward of the axles. And then on top of that, possibly a little bit of storage for firewood, but I'm not... I'm not set on that. Um, all of these latches are getting old. I don't love them. Um, they're working okay so far. Um, you can see that hinge is rusted to the bejeebus. So that's going to get replaced with a plastic hinge. And I'll need to have a look at this window and do something there. Um, what else? There are some white up in there, but I can't find the globes that click onto them so I've used these three dollar Bunnings jobbies which have been whoosh, excellent um, there is a power outlet inlet here an outlet in there but there's no circuit breaker on it so I'm not plugging anything into that until I get an electrician to have a good look at that all right so as I build more of this I will share more with you um, if you've got any questions about what I want to do, or you've got any suggestions you want to make, please put it in the comments below.